Can I come in? Can't do for you. You can leave my dad alone. Ah. So he's finally cracked and told you? Yeah, I've known for weeks. So what were you doing, uh, biding your time? Yeah. Yeah? Something like that, yeah. Or maybe you were just, uh, scared. Look, I just, I just want you to leave my dad alone. Why would I do that? Because he's been through enough. And I'm not just going to stand by and watch while you make him give false evidence. So what are you going to do? I'll tell the police. That'd be stupid. Right now, I can't work out whether you are brave or stupid. And if you're stupid, you could just turn around, walk out, or forget this ever happened. And I can put it down to you inheriting your dad's stupid gene. My dad's not. Well, if you're brave, stick around. Tough it out. Convince me. So what is it? Brave or stupid? Oh, I see. Now we've got a modern-day hero. I like that, cos uh, I hate stupid people. Now, where were we? You were going to tell me what you're going to do. It's 500 quid. It's yours. Thanks for the donation. What? What, you think you're gonna walk in and throw around some loose change and the problem will go away? Cos that really is stupid. <sighs> OK. Fine. I get it. You hold all the cards. There's nothing I can do. But you should know that my dad... He's been thinking about doing a runner lately. Yeah, you see... He can't handle the pressure. I can see it in his eyes. So if you force him to testify, he's going to crack under cross-examination. And when he does, he's going to take you down with him. See that? Sounds more like a threat. And that's brave. So you're not going to force him to give evidence? I'll consider all my options, and I'll get back to you and your dad later. Sheets. Sorry, mate. Oh, you dropped your wallet. Thanks. Who did this to you? 